Hey everybody, welcome back. Happy Sunday. Let's give it a minute here till everybody jumps in the room. I know there's a lot of early birds waiting. I'm just kicking it off. We're going to take a look at a few different knives today. But I want to give a little bit of a hey how are ya. Just a little bit of the 940 Osborne family. You know, happy Sunday. It's kind of been expanded a little bit. We have our 940 family that's expanded to the, the little guys, the little gals, the 945. Mini Osbournes, front and center. How are you guys doing today? Happy Sunday. Man, so many great people early in the live chat. Thank you so much. I saw Uncle Cal, Katie, or I'm sorry, Lacey, uh, Big Red EDC. I'm seeing Form D Productions, Paul Miller, Bell's Blades, Richard Hendershot, all members of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. Thanks for being here. I'm seeing Sharp Bevel, DC McCallan, Jason Brown was there early, Kloss, I Love Knives is here, Ryan Pearson in the house custom knife maker brian's in the house shout out to aubrey what's up thanks for being here aubrey 2873 lone wolf sue chicken z-man's edc also member of zach's daily carry crew thanks for being here g-man w what's happening didier is here what's up didier rodney's in the house what's up rodney also a member of zach's daily carry crew thanks for the support Thank you so much. Big Red EDC got the blue wrench. Holding down the moderator status. Thank you so much, my friend. And I don't know, are we level here? I'll probably put the knives out not super level, but you get the idea. We're looking at some beauties here. We also have some really cool knives sent in. Uh, what's up, Manny Z? Michael Morgan, One Minute Knife Reviews. Crystal's in the house. What's happening? Got Max in the house. Shout out to Max. Katie, Mrs. Eggs and Ham 22. We also have Eggs and Ham 22 in the house. Thank you guys for joining. Happy Sunday. Yes, we have some beautiful knives here. These are those beautiful mala scales, rock scale designs, that beautiful backspacer. Just slapped it on to a 940. Titanium, the milling. Super beautiful. Just got to say. Yeah, so we have a super secret thing happening. If you haven't checked it out, please check out my community tab. But I think we're doing it May 20th. So May 20th will be the day. Oh, Big Red throwing the link for Rock Scale in there. Thanks, buddy. You didn't have to do that, but I appreciate you rocking the links. Dan Brock's in the house. What's up, buddy? Oh, you got your patch yesterday. Right on. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, I did a huge push out uh, shipping wise. Got out like over 30 packages to you guys. Um, shipped them out. I want to make sure you guys got your patches, a couple stickers, uh, just for you guys supporting. So thank you guys so much. Also, you see people here. They have the little green and the ZS next to their name. Um, that just tells you how long they've been a member of Zach's Day of the Carry Crew. And they got access to these custom emojis for any time you're leaving a comment on my videos or here in the live chat. It's very supportive. It helps keep the channel going. So anyways, we're rocking it. I know you guys are getting pumped. There's a lot of you guys going to Blade Show. I'm excited for that coming up. Um, it's only here in the next, like, what, three weeks? Unfortunately, I will not be going to Blade Show in June. It's very sad. I had originally planned on going, but I wasn't able to. So my work still has a travel quarantine in place. Now there's a lot of stuff changing over the next week or two. Who knows? Um, but right now we still have a 10 day quarantine when we come back from commercial travel. So it's just wild. CK is in the house. What's happening? Other than intended purpose in the house. So all of you guys who are going, please, please have an awesome time. Please send me a couple photos, any kind of, uh, you know, good times you guys get into. What's up, Luke? What's up, Cole Cochran? 
Give a huge shout out to Cole um, and also NAS Sergeant. We're going to be coming up chatting about those guys here in a few. Cole is one of Zach's daily carry crew. He also sent in a couple knives to review, but I want to give you a sneak peek. And the NAF Sergeant's got a surprise for all of us, so we'll talk about that in a little bit. But, um, yeah, if you want a sticker, send me an email, zach.edc at gmail.com. Uh, I'll, I'll mail you out a little sticker, no problem. Uh, if you want a patch, a, a DSKFS, do something kind for someone, they are a few bucks. Uh, include that in the email. We can figure out how to get payment, and I'll get it shipped out to you. All good. But they're pretty cool. They're pretty awesome. I know a lot of you guys have been rocking them this last week. I know Z-Mans, he said last night over on Big Red's uh, Saturday Knife Live. He did a little, uh, hey, man, I'm rocking it on my backpack. And, that, and that's cool. It's getting the word out there. Somebody's going to ask you, hey, what's DSKFS? And that right there is what it's all about. And it's keeping that mindset, you know. Do something kind for someone. Love that. What's up, Scott Simmons, David Iverson, members of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. Thanks for being here. Oh, yeah. That's good stuff. That's pretty cool, man. That's pretty cool. So, the question always comes up. This is kind of a rough draft version of... This one's not really on camera, but that's the titanium one that came out last year. But Blade Show West, I'll be there. So look for me, Blade Show West. We're going to be doing some fun things. And we're going to be doing some live streams, Blade Show West, in October. So look for that. More to come. Probably some uh, SKL on the road. Might even involve like a tattoo parlor. I'm just kind of throwing out some hints. What's up, Rusty? What's up, Robbie? What's happening? So all sorts of fun stuff planned, having fun, already got tickets, already got a place to stay for October, Long Beach, LBC, be having some fun. So if you guys are going to be able to go or even stop by, rock and roll. We got NAF Sergeant in the house. What's up, buddy? I talked about you just a minute ago. Uh, you and Cole have sent some things into the channel to be reviewed. We're going to take a look at that, but also... There's a surprise from NAF Sergeant. So I'll tell you right now, he's got some cool videos up on his channel. So, but we'll talk about that in just a little bit. Get a little sip of coffee. <laughs> Jason says that he still he still thinks that JB and I need to buy an Amazon tattoo kit and give tattoos to each other. Yeah, I don't know. I we're gonna try to, you know, get down to like LA Inc. or something. What's up, Don C? Yeah, happy Sunday indeed. Yeah, smash that like button. Heck yeah. So, question always comes up. Which one of these is my favorite? I think you guys know. It's not really hard. I carry it all the time. If I had to pick one, it'd be this one right here. It'd be the 940BK-2002. Just need to black out the liner and black out that axis bar. That's more to follow. But I'm hoping we got enough pressure out there. I hope this becomes like a staple model or hint, hint, bench made. Just a little FYI. Put the 940, some blue G10 in the customizer. Come on now. How awesome would that be? Be throwing it down. You just transfer my paycheck directly. What's up, Mariana? How are you? D2 Arcara, how are you? Lancelot Leather, what's up, buddy? Thanks for being here. Happy Sunday. But, you know, what's your guys' favorite? You know, we got full titanium, flat scales, red accents. We got a 942. A 942, so 942 directly. It's got the titanium backspacer. We have the original 940 from 20 years ago. We got the Cabela's exclusive with that kind of diamond wood and carbon fiber, which is just beautiful. 
It's D2, though. <laughs> Just kidding. No knock on that. We got another one with the Black Blade. Original, says Zach. Um, those are kind of cool. You got that Blade HQ exclusive with the G10. I like the blacked out. I was thinking about getting an extra one of these and taking the liners and the, the axis bar and swapping out on that one. Of course, you got the beautiful 9400, the push button auto. What's up, Hunter? Hey, thanks for being here, man. I appreciate it. You got the Smoky Mountain Knife Works exclusive, that red resin carbon fiber, one of the most gorgeous ones, I have to say. Then, of course, you have that REI exclusive, green G10, purple barrel spacers. The beautiful going gear exclusive, that red SeaTac inlay. Came out with the black titanium and blue hardware this year, or sorry, 2020. That was gorgeous. And this is the international exclusive, the Dama Steel Blade. Kind of that yellow gold backspacer. Of course, we looked at the G10 in blue. The Knife Works exclusive. Fabulous. Then, of course, the 940-1. I did put blue thumb studs on it, but this is a stock version you can get still to this day. Ever seen the Pinnacle? Not in person. No, 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 no way. OG, still your favorite, Cole? Nice. Are 940 parts readily available? Uh, you can definitely go check out. There's some stuff on Etsy that I've seen. What's up, Pro X 1840? Nice, black with the blue hardware. Yeah, it's a beautiful one. Push button autos are nice. You know, you got the, the new Mini 945, kind of a throwback they did with the aluminum scales, but it's the Mini version. And then, of course, the Mini 945 with the blue and black G10. That's, that's my favorite combo pairing right there, those two. But, yeah, so, oh, yeah, Robbie, you like the SMKW exclusive? Yeah. <laughs> so, KJ, what's up, buddy? Welcome, welcome. Member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. It says, one does not simply ignore a full-grown Siberian Husky when it makes a request, Big Red, at risk of her demolishing the house, literally. <laughs> what's up, Deadpool? Thanks for being here, buddy. Jason, what's happening, Jason? Tim Shanks in the house. Yeah, the Cabela's is nice. What's up, Dennis? Mark, what's happening? Thanks for being here. Oh, you sold your 940? Oh, you didn't carry very much? Hey, it happens. You know? It's one of those things. You got to be like, okay, what are we going to go with? Hey, Chicago 23's in the house. What's happening? So awesome. So let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to take these knives and put them on a tray. It's a little bit off screen because I think we need to look at some cool stuff that came in and really give a huge shout out to a couple people that are here in this community. Send some things in to look at. I'll show you my tray as soon as I get it loaded up here. It's pretty fun. A tray of 940s. Now, I really hope there's more 940s planned for 2021. I'm not super positive in it, but you never know. It could be one of those like hidden gems that, I mean, they went pretty hard with them last year, so they may be taking a year off. I honestly would love to see like, uh, I mean, we did the, you know, the 20 year anniversary, so last year. So that's why I was kind of, but there's your tray of 940s, that purple carbon fiber tray. So we'll set this one off to the side here. Now, what can we look at that's come in? Hmm. 
How about we take a peek at what Cole, Cole Cochran, who's in the chat here. Yeah, right, Jason. I wish that I, I wish I could totally do that. That would be so awesome. Cole sent in a couple knives. Now I do have to say, it's not a blue box. What's up, Dominic? OCD 3DC, what's up, buddy? Working on the farm. You be listening? All right, right on. Well, you came in at the right time because Cole sent in a couple red and black and silver boxes. And I have to tell you, these are pretty cool because they are exclusives. And look at that. So huge shout out to Cole. Why don't we show some, show some love for Cole in the chat? Let's put a little love out there for Cole. Thank you so much, my friend. That was really awesome of you to send these in so I could take a look at them. I don't get a lot of the exclusive Spider Co's. So being able to check them out, kind of that lime green G10, which looks gorgeous. CPM 20 CV. Look at that, the pair of three. What do you guys think? That's pretty cool. So that's a cool one that Cole sent in, so thank you very much. But this one, this next one, what's up, Newfoundland knife guy? How's it going? Mark Kaufman's in the house too. Yeah, the green looks really good in person. What's up, Thomas? Look at that. I think this one is, uh, is it Knife Joy? Let me look at the paperwork. Oh, Cutlery Shop. They're the orange ones. That's right. Cutlery Shop. Oh, my. Oh, thank you very much, KJ. Thank you, guys. Yeah. My goodness. That is all I can say. The Shaman. Uh, I'll look at it in just a second, Lacey. Yeah. The XHP. Yeah, Beaver Special, black and orange. I never understood why they didn't do the liners, but maybe friction. What's up, Knives Fast? What's going down? Yeah, Justin, man, I got I opened this up a little bit earlier and I'm like, oh my goodness. The look of this is crazy, and then literally the scales feel incredible. So yeah, Cole, I don't know if you're gonna get them back. No, I'm just kidding. I'm trying to be gentle. They're not really broken in. They're still brand new. So I'm trying to be nice with them. But yeah, that's gorgeous. And uh, Lacey wanted to look at this one. This is the Knife Joy exclusive. No numbers on that one. Just the Spyderco marking, the blade and all that. What's up, Andrew? Andrew's in the house. Another member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. What's up, Gary? Yeah, it'd be nice if they gave some, like, even sent you a deep carry clip with it. What's up, Mechanic Mike? Hey, hey, welcome, welcome. Thanks for being here. Yeah, so really, really cool of Cole. So thank you again, Cole. There'll be some reviews coming up on those in the next week or two. I'll probably do one a week. I'll get them back to you, I will. I know. <laughs> no, I appreciate it, man. That's so awesome. Literally, that's really awesome. And I'm really, I like, I, you know, this green wasn't really growing on me. You know, when I saw the post of it, I was like, man, eh, okay. But in person, it looks pretty incredible. So we'll put those off to the side. Make sure that they get their due respect. But man, the Shaman, that's a great knife. Needs one of those, uh, CMEs, compression made easies, right? That OCD sells. <laughs> Get a little black and orange on there or something. That'd look kind of trick. Okay. Now, oh, you're carrying the shaman today? Yeah, we got we got 75 people in here. Why don't we do a little uh, pocket check today? Let's do pocket check. What are you guys carrying today? Oh, Lynch or Northwest is selling some. Oh, right on. Uh, 
Okay. G-Man's got the uh, Benchmade 945 American Blade Works version 6. Oh, nice. Oh, you have a CME, Lacey? Nice. Paul, what's up, Paul? The Pena X Moolah Sinfat Carbon Fiber. I Love Knives got the CRK and Kosi Knife Sergeants filling with the Anthem. Oh, man. I love the Anthem. Oh, what's up, Kark Nelson? Welcome. Oh, Richard's got the 940. Napster Ninja, what's up, buddy? Got the uh, PM3. Got the KJ's got the Man X2 XL. Woo, it's a big one. Spider Coast Smock from Didier. Eggs and Hams got the TS243 Carbon Fiber. Jason Brown has a Kia QSP Gannett. Robbie Tim's got the small Savenza 31. I like my 31. I can imagine the small ones just as beautiful. Ryan Pearson's got the OG bug out. Nice, Ryan. By the way, if you haven't seen Ryan's new little uh, small fixed blade, you should go check that out on his Instagram. That's pretty cool stuff. Uh, Titanium Malibu for one minute knife reviews. Gold class Tangu. Oh, nice. I thought I had another one here. Hold on, I'm gonna put a couple knives out. We haven't seen these in a little bit. Try not to make my other one fall over. Put a couple knives out while we're uh, going over the pocket checks. Uh, let's see here. Z-Man's got the Tangram Vector. Love the button lock. Big Tunda, what's happening? Max Ace Goliath 2. Big Red's got the QSP Penguin Red Micarta, of course. Rocking the red. Rusty's got the Demco Knives 8020MG and 3V. Sandra Knives Torino, Tungsten Carbide, and Victorinox Pioneer X. Kark's got the Holt Haptic. It's a beautiful knife. Bell's Blade's got the Gavco Thresher. Dennis got the QSP Parrot Artisan Jungle. Tim Shanks got the Full Size Griptilian and Case Peanut. Uncle Cow's got the Spider Co. Clip It tool. Cody W., what's happening? We got the XM18 DLT exclusive. Man, I still want to check out an XM18. I'm hoping, really hoping, that um, Slicey, when he sends my ProTech back, he'll let me borrow an XM18 to check out. Uh, D2's got the Elementum S35. Oh, nice. That's a nice one. Dominic's got the CRK TCEO Flipper. Oh, that CEO flipper is pretty cool. That's the only thing that with the CEO that I had was that thumb stud was really, really close. Oh, okay, Peter. That's really nice of you. Welcome, welcome. Therapeutic Edges here. Also rocking the moderator link. So that's cool. That's cool. Um, Let's see here. Carrying the Mark's got the Kershaw Scallion Acid Black Wash. Wow. That probably looks sick. Uh, other than intended purpose of the BK40, just got it as a gift. Giving it pocket time to see how I feel about it for your review. That's great. I, I really like the idea of carrying that stuff before you give a, a full review. I found some knives that are like, oh, it changes your mind once you carry them. Either way. Uh, let's see here. Michael Morgan's got the Roper Buffalo Scout and Rough Rider High Plains Large Toothpick. ProX 1840's got the Best Tech Komodo and the Slenderman EMP EDC. Ooh, I'll have to look that one up. Uh, Rodney's got the Mini Presidio Auto 5750. That's a good one. That's a good one. I like the Auto Presidio. Um, CK's got the Full Size Adamas and Mini Osborne. Oh, right on, right on. OCD for EDC. Beating the Kaiser Slicer again today. Taking it like a champ. Nice. Manny's got the 20 CV Kapara. That's one of my favorite spider codes, by the way. I love the Kapara. Andrew Arnold's got the S45VN Pair 3. Paper Tiger's got the AKC Switchblade. Lancelot Leathers at the CEO for Slim Carry today. Perfect Slim Carry. Uh, Andrew's got the All Black Shaman. Nice. S30, uh, S30V and the Ritter Mini RSK1. Gary's got the Bug Out and Through Night T1. 
Joshua Dub has got the bench made proper sheep foot Makarta. I love the Makarta. So beautiful. Yeah, Josh, with proper is a beautiful, wonderful Sunday carry. Uh, what's up, Northwoods Knife Guy? Another member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew carrying the Auto Presidio M4. Right on. Cole's got the full titanium Hinder XM18 3.5 Sponto. Lacey's got the purple glittered Elementum and Glow Macarta. Or no, Glow and a Glow Delica. Oh. Lacey's rocking it today. That's fantastic. Stauffer, EDC, the tactile rock wall. Rockwell. Rockwell? Rockwall. Uh, Stauffer, I got my number came up. Should I get it? Or should I not? I'm going to have to pull some money out. I'm going to have to dip into the savings a little bit to grab one of those. I just don't know size-wise if they're where it's at. Oh, thanks, Big Red. <laughs> ID Wolverine's got the Knife Center exclusive bug out. Concept Cryo for Don C. The OD Green Micarta. Got the Presidio from Northwoods. Yeah, it's a rock wall. Okay. Thomas, what's up? It's a fantastic little knife. Oh, see? I don't know. I have to... Man, I got to check out a couple reviews on that before I pull the trigger. Because I don't, I don't know if... I mean... It's gorgeous. The million's fantastic, but the size is what I'm worried about. Mark Kaufman said, baby just woke up. Got to go. See you later. All right, Mark. Take care, buddy. Thomas has the uh, Protec Newport today. Blue and black. Oh, I like the Protecs. That Newport's cool. You like the CME? A little biased. Yeah, I got you, Justin. Penny. What's up, Penny? Another member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. Everybody, let's give a little shout out to Penny. Penny hasn't been here uh, too lately. Uh, hope you're feeling better, Penny. Yeah, Shadow. What's up, buddy? So this is a uh, mini Crooked River Gold Class from Benchmade. Just beautiful. It has the marble carbon fiber and the Refer Noble uh, inlay. C-Tech. And then you got the Bug Out from Benchmade. Gold, both Gold Classes. Hope those are good. Uh, let's see, Spider Coast Mock for Kloss. Very nice. Pair of three, S35VN, Brown G10 for Form D, nice. Spider Coast Native 5 in the Salt, LC200N and Gerber Pry Bar. That's cool, Newfoundland. Got the Adamus for David Iverson, nice. Knives Fast has also got the QSP Gannet today. Very cool. Oh, and the Finch Runtley. Woo, nice. Very cool. Jason has the... Oh, you got the new Claymore. Yeah, buddy. Is my Claymore nearby? I just got to snap it once. What's up, Mrs. OCD? That's the Claymore. <laughs> Firing on all cylinders. I love that thing. I might have to get one in black here this summer. All right. Um, Susan, what's up, Susan? Got the mini 945 green handle. Nice. Marcos Gamma, what's happening? Got the Benchmade Emissary. Nice. Protex Sprint with a B Hanks teal color with Darth Vader Sugar Skull. I bet that looks fantastic. <laughs> Oh, Sue Chicken, Best Tech Textile, Rough Rider, Red Bow Trapper, nice. Tariq, what's up, Tariq? 3.15 a.m. Oh, man, thanks for being here. I know, I know that is crazy awesome of you to get up and be here. So, thank you, Tariq. And Tariq, by the way, Tariq's got some, some special stuff. I'm just going to say that for now. I don't want to. I don't want to give away the surprise, but Tariq, Tariq showed me something that might be coming this way. I'm like, oh my, oh my goodness. Uh, Ethan ruins EDC. What's up, buddy? Remember Zach's daily carry crew. He's carrying the Benchmade Mini Presidio Two. Uh, CK is in the house, of course. Tim Cook, empty pockets since it's rain and relax day. Bunch of kitchen knives. Oh, nice. Get them all sharpened up. Yeah, do something kind for someone. Right on. 
Therapeutic Edge. Peter's in the house. Got the bug out today. Oh, nice. Galavman MC22. What's happening, buddy? Oh, that's super cool, Peter, if you do that. That's very nice. Thanks, Big Red, for putting that link up there for Pearson Custom Knives. What's up, John Evans? Got the Spartan Blades Aster today. SMKW Bug Out for Galavan. Nice. Scott Simmons got the K Bar BK62 Kephart Fixed Blade and GEC44 Gunstock for Woods Carry today. Watching from a campsite at the Dismal Swamp Park here in VA. Right on, buddy. Having some fun cabin, camping. Thanks for being here. What's up, Mark Grant? Another member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. Nebu Clouds in the house. What's happening? Oh, Cole's got a few XMs. Nice, nice. Susan also forgot the Mukuruti Wood. Runtley. Nice. Red Drive Strip 2. The Benchmade Super Freak and PM2 Tanto Blade HQ Jade swapped for tie scales. That's a beautiful upgrade. Beautiful upgrade. Kark's got the XM18 3.5 Skinny Slicer. You can borrow. It has blue and black scales. Oh, blue and black. Woo. Mr. Kluver's in the house. What's up, Mr. Kluver? Todd Carr, what's happening, buddy? How you doing? What's up, Katie? Oh, man. XM24 and XM3.5, 18, 3.5 Bowie and my Eclipse for David Iverson. Yeah, I'm just getting caught up on the, on the, the pocket checks right now. Mrs. OCD's in the house. BD Swaim got the 20 CB Capara. Nice. Dustin, what's happening? Highly considered getting a Crooked River or Mini Crooked River. Currently carrying an M4 SMKW bug out. So just so you know, here's your comparison to a bug out. And this is the Mini Crooked River. And there might just be a Smoky Mountain Knife Works exclusive bug out right there. So you can get a size comparison. Mini Crooked River, SMKW exclusive bug out. That way you know. What's up, Paper Tiger? Sharp Bevel's got the Shaman and S30V. Nice. KJ's got the Kapara 2 and he loves it. Love the Pair 3 from Shadow. Kershaw Launch 4 and SMKW bug out for Galavan. Proper, yeah, buddy. Can't beat a proper on a Sunday. Shadow Realm's got the Shaman and Damascus. Nice. Mrs. OCD's polishing trophy scopes today, in fact. There you go. Two awesome live shows are going to happen today. Just so you guys know. Oh, thanks, Big Red. Benchmade bug out link there. Um, also, if you're going to go over... What's up, Knife Nut? If you're going to go over to SMKW and pick up anything or one of these exclusive bug outs, go to Big Red's channel, any of his videos. Click his affiliate link first. You know, because he uses that to support the knife of the month that he gives away. So it, it's it's not going to matter anything on what you buy. But that little bit of, of support goes right back to his channel, which I think is super cool that he uses it for that. So that's awesome. I just like to throw that out there. When I buy my knives from SMKW, my exclusives, all that stuff, I click his link first and then go there. So I'm just putting that out there. You know what I mean? Just putting that out there. Nobody's racking on rocking a banter today. I know. What's up with that? That's craziness, huh? Penny's here. Heck yeah. Dustin says, which one do I like more? I like the mini Crooked River. To me, I have a large glove size hand. It fits perfectly on here. Um, plenty of blade. Very, very, you know, with that, that point you get. Very, very cutty very slicey very stabby what's up emma how you doing so i like the mini crooked river i have several customs that i've made exclusives as well um i only have one full size and it's it's pretty large so if you have like extra large hands or something bigger then go with the full size but i would say for a regular edc the mini crooked river is perfect for you very cool. What's up, NASCAR Racer? Got the Kaiser Sway back in red. You watching the Monster Mile today? I saw that was just kicking off here a little bit ago. 
Kaiser Roach and Titanium S35VN for Chicago. Nice. Oh, you're on the ATV. Nice, Newfoundland. Yeah, buddy. I know. We try. <laughs> if you can get your hands on the Anthem, uh, I would say if you like that version of it, yes. Um, I would imagine they're working on another version, hopefully. What's up, Lisa? How you doing? But be very, very careful of um, fakes that are out there. A lot of fake anthems out in the world. So just be very careful of that. Mr. Kluver, welcome back. Got the brown elemental button lock again today. Very, very cool. We're going to look at those in just a minute. One of those in just a minute here. And of course, Nebu Cloud, what's happening? I think I'm getting caught up, hopefully. BD Swam, yeah, you know, 10,000 subs is coming up. We're doing our 10 for 10K. We're going to have 10 giveaways for the 10K. So I'm putting together the prize packs right now. Uh, there's already been some people that have sent some stuff in. A couple companies that have, uh, you know, said, yep, we're in. We're, we're getting some stuff together. So that's cool. What's up, Nick Martino? What's happening? And some people here in the community that have already like put some stuff together. So you guys are amazing. And I will definitely cover all of that. Oh, you got the trash panda in the pocket. Nice. Right on, Jason. I think I'm getting caught up on comments here. Oh my goodness. Form D Productions. Thank you so much, my friend. We got to show some love for Form D Productions. Everybody show some love. Thank you so much for the super chat. And Form D, I think you you got a swag pack, right? I just want to make sure you already got one. Because if not, we're going to make sure you get one. Did I miss? Oh, what's happening? I can't read your name. I'm sorry. We have a new member. What's up, Poncho 151? Got the Benchmade Super Freak and Spider Co. Warncliffe and Dura. Fabulous. Last Ranger. What's up, buddy? That is awesome, Form D. Thank you very much. And that support is awesome. All right, Tariq. Take care, buddy. Get some rest. Thanks for being here. Thanks for being an awesome member of the community, uh, the community too. Tree Stabbing Troy. What's up, buddy? Oh, that's cool. That's cool, David. <laughs> you don't like cars? That doesn't sound very positive. That doesn't very sound very positive at all. Okay. So let's take those gold classes off. Let's get a sip of uh, coffee here. I had to brew up some, uh, some Maui coffee here in my little insulated mug was a very, very awesome gift that Big Red sent me. Oh, Big Red. Oh, he beat you to it, the 10 for 10K. Oh, Kark. Oh, you're welcome for the swag pack, my friend. Thank you so very much. Let's show some love, some support. That's for Kark. Of course, for Big Red. We're gonna show some love for Big Red as well. Thank you, my friend. Oh, I put too many in there. There we go. I got that custom red emoji for Big Red. I had to do it. Had to do it. Thank you guys so very much. That is fantastic. But something really cool. We saw what Cole sent in. So I'm going to go ahead, make sure that is off my list. Because somebody else sent some stuff in. And that is NAF Sergeant. Oh, you guys. NAF Sergeant, if you haven't checked out his channel, please do so. Some cool videos on there. And he jumps in on everybody's stuff, too. So he's a member of the community as well. What's up, Deborah? Member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. Thanks for being here. Grateful Panic. What's up, buddy? Another member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. Hit the like button. <laughs> yeah, definitely. We're getting about 100 people. But so, 
some cool stuff sent in, you know, nice package. Had to open it up because I was like, what's what's inside? But we got some cool stickers from NAF Sergeant. We're going to be sharing some of these. We're going to be putting them in the giveaway as well. Some really cool stickers that he sent in. Thank you very much. That is awesome. A little throwback to the, the Sergeant Stripes. What's up, Chad? What's going on, buddy? George French, what's up, buddy? Another member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. Thanks for being here. But he sent in a couple knives for me to check out and to share. And these are the bird knives. And I haven't seen too many of the bird knives. And this one is the Metal Lark 2 and G10. So what do you guys think on, on the bird knives? Yeah, Big Red, thanks for the link, buddy. So that's a that's a link right there to Nav Sergeant's YouTube channel. Please go check him out. Give him a subscribe. Give him some feedback as well, because the feedback's always important. Um, you know, solid built. Little forward finger choil. Get you on there. You like bird knives? Yeah, I haven't seen too many of them. So I'll be I'll be carrying these. Doing a couple of little reviews on them as well. Look at that one. <laughs> and this one is, what's it called? The Rescue 2. This one's the Rescue 2. That's fully legit right there. Oh, it's right on the scale. So, yeah. So, you know, that's, that's one of the things. Like, they have that line out there, the bird. I mean, that one seems super sharp, so we're going to test them out a little bit. We're going to see how they work. We might even take them to our friend, uh, Tom, you know, polish up the serrations. But, yeah, these are really cool. So, Nav Sergeant, thanks for sending those in, man, so I can check those out and share with the community. Now, he also sent another one to check out, and... Oh, you can flick them both? Okay. <laughs> nice. He sent another one to check out. And I've seen this one a little bit. But I haven't seen this version. And so it was really cool to see this version pop up. And this is the Olive Macarta Civivi Button Lock. And I know there's that controversy, controversy, controversy out there. I like the coloring. I like the blue, or I'm sorry, I like the black and hardware. That olive green Macarta. It locks when it closes. Now I know the biggest thing comes is, are these gonna be considered a gravity knife? But, it's had some modification. Okay, okay, nice, nice. Gotcha. But, beautiful, beautiful knife. Uh, I just posted up one of the dark Macarta, and the dark Macarta has a rough texture feel to it. This olive one has more of a smooth feel to it. So, pretty awesome stuff. Now, you can see a review over on Nav Sergeant's channel on this one, and you might be seeing this this knife later. And of course, it has a, a hidden lanyard post. So, anyways. The Button Lock Macarta Elementum. This is the olive one. Behind the camera, it's a little more difficult to flip out. But you guys get the idea. It's pretty cool stuff. So, very cool of him to send that out over to check out. And like I said, we'll, we'll talk more about this one sooner than later. Most definitely sooner than later. So, very cool. So, sh show some love for Naf Sergeant as well. Head over to his channel there. Big Red put the link up. Give him a subscribe. Give him that feedback. That is amazing stuff in the community. So, kind of cool. Especially when, you know, people have reached out to me and are like, Hey, man, I can't get a hold of a Benchmade or something. I want to check it out and review it. I put my own knives into our pass around group. Because I think it's important to, you know, really be able to check out and see what's out there. And sometimes, 
you know yeah they're sold out they have a whole nother run coming i know the button locks they went fast everywhere um that's the only negative part to it and i think that's one of those you know first time doing it they were like oh what do we do and sure enough you know they were a hit so being a little bit larger than the standard elementum i think that for me is what i really like about it <laughs> follically challenged oh that's <laughs> that's too funny yeah nick i agree i love micarta as well so other than intended purpose yeah shoot me an email uh zach.edc at gmail.com hey what's up women carry knives oh no no worries at all thanks for being here another member of zach's daily carry crew thanks for the support um i will say though two great live streams going on today One's going to be at 2.30 p.m. Pacific, Women Carry Knives channel. Um, her and a therapeutic edge are going to be going live. And then later today, 8 p.m. Central will be OCD for EDC. And, of course, Mrs. OCD for EDC. That'll be, that's always a fun one. Um, I didn't check. Maybe I would imagine Bruise and Blades is still happening. Slicey Dicey today. 5 p.m. Sorry. 8 p.m. Eastern. 5 p.m. Pacific. I have to look at it in my time. So try to try to say them in everybody's time so they get them. Um, but I did find out something that was really cool um, that I saw this last week. And I don't know if you guys saw it or not. But it's some stuff from our friends at Hitch and Timber. And I had to order them because I really like the idea behind it. Um, and this is going to help me carry a couple things that are important EDC-wise. Um, let's see here. What's up, Mark Grant? Uh, Leland says, I wish they had the carbon shred scales without Damascus. I, I hope to see that too. I hope to see that too. I love, I'd love a black wash blade, like on that olive one, um, on the, on like the blue shredded carbon fiber. That'd be fantastic. I would buy that one probably twice. Oh, thanks. Tree stabbing Troy. Just subscribe to Nav Sergeant. Yeah, there's so many great channels. That's why, you know, when somebody, you know, reaches out and is like, hey, we're going to do something, oh, man, you got to support, you know. But these right here, I have to tell you, are pretty cool. And these are called the Torch Slip. And it's something that Hitch and Timber came out with. Very, very quality, good quality products. But he puts in the, uh, the little elastic pouch on the side. Yeah, the logo is pretty cool. They put in the pouch on the side, and this is one that, oh, you did tumbling on the blade? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. It was regular black. Oh, well, it looks great. The tumbling you did looks great. Now, Hitch and Timber makes some really cool products as well. This is one that I carry quite often, as you can tell. This one's a proper, Benchmade proper slip. It's got my carbon fiber proper in it. And that beautiful kind of uh, blueberry colored um, space pen, the bullet space pens. This one's in like aluminum or whatever. Fantastic, easy to carry. You know, it's got the, the space pen refill, so, it, you know, it's going to write anywhere. So it fits right in there elastic wise. And this is one of those that you can take, this is an i5T. EOS. It's the uh, AA battery version. But you can basically slip this right over and carry it. Perfect. So I liked this. I like the look of it. You can also put in a smaller one, you know, some like a i3. You can put in a little bit bigger ones too, as it will get bigger, as you can see. But I like this setup. Yeah, I agree. You know, a little bit of slant down for the pocket clip. It's kind of built into it. Yeah, the space pin's gorgeous. They make some different colors, all that good stuff. Yeah, there's the link right there to Hitch and Timber Slip Joint uh, or uh, Torch Slip. Now, I purchased these. You know, they don't provide them, but I like to show off good products when they come in that make your EDC useful to carry. Um, this, to me, is going gonna, is gonna to be incorporated starting tomorrow into my daily carry. So you'll see a little bit of this going on 
because normally the flashlight has been the hardest thing for me to carry in my pocket because where I clip pockets or where I clip stuff on my pockets, I have knives. Yeah, and there's the space pin, the bullet space pins. There's a, there's a whole selection of these. They have like commemorative ones for different flights and then they have different colors and materials and you can get brass, copper, aluminum, steel, all that good stuff. So yeah, so I think this is really cool. Um, you'll, this brown one right here is beautiful and you'll probably see that one coming up on a giveaway in the next couple weeks, this brown one. So I didn't want to put anything in that one. I want to keep that new, but this black one, I think it's gorgeous. So that's just, just what I'm putting out there. <laughs> want to share that with you guys. Oh, the uncle, uncle John's band. Nice. Yeah, that's so funny. That's awesome. What's up, Randy F? Mark says, I'll take that whole setup. Yeah, it's really cool. So, and there's some O-lights that are out there. Um, I know they go, you know, but I've seen like DLT has some of the I-5Ts in stock, uh, River's Edge Cutlery, some other ones, all that good stuff. So those are some cool things that are out there just for your EDC use, you know. But just want to make sure you guys saw what's out there and available. I saw that one pop up last week, and I'm like, man, I like those. Uh, that one's called the Torch Slip. So Hitch and Timber is the company name, and it's called the Torch Slip. And I know there's some other companies that, you know, like uh, Tale of Knives does a bigger one where you get your torch, your pen, your your knife and those kind of things. Hey, hey, what's up, Blade Edge? Thanks for being here. Remember Zach's Day the Carry Crew? But to me, like I said, I'm gonna carry my other knives, you know, nearby, easily accessible. Oh, these are sold out already? Well, keep an eye on his Instagram, uh, Hitch and Timber, because he did a, a short run of these and they'll be putting a lot more out, so. Oh, Hitch and Timber has those as well. Okay, cool. Perfect. Yeah, so he's got a bunch of different products. So, yeah, it's a it's a great, great combo. So, kind of an upgrade from the proper slip. You know, I might have to buy one that I can put my proper in now too, but I like the little, the little compact version of this because I can throw this in even a pair of shorts or my bag or something. So... The one that fit knives. Yeah. Oh, okay. I got you. I see what you're saying there, Last Ranger. Oh, everything else is sold out but the torch slip. So they have the torch slip. Perfect. Yeah. Well, that's what I thought because I know he just put these out last week. So, you know, small manufacturers, you know, they do stuff. Yeah, they are, Jason. They're great people. And they've sent stuff to me before for review and for giveaway. So... I've always liked that big time. Um, so I, I have two more things that got sent in um, for, for review that one is almost like ceremonial. Um, and you guys might know as soon as you see the box, but I have to give a huge shout out. Oh, you got the new Auto Domus? Yeah, it's pretty slick. <laughs> what's up winchester inc uh, do you have any custom shop bug outs andrew martinez says yes i do i have several of them it's pretty cool hey 3902 john what's up thanks for being here but a huge shout out to my friend big red edc big red if you can put a link to your channel up here that would be fantastic because I didn't realize, now I, I opened this up, but I have not pulled it out and seen what's happening. So this is going to be my first time experiencing this knife, <laughs> Rusty. It's a knife from M-Tech. And I was like, okay. And it came, it came shipped from, it looked like somebody's house, right? And I'm like, oh, okay. And so I had to open up the package and I'm like, what is this all about? Yeah, there's a link to Big Red's channel. If you haven't, if you haven't subscribed to Big Red, then you're missing out. So 
definitely go subscribe to Big Red EDC. Oh, it's even got a little. It's even got a little piece of tape here. Hold on. Got to keep that knife secure. <laughs> but M Tech USA, it's got the USA flag on it, and I heard that this was the Shadow Ranger. And I'm going to have to get a little more to the story on that. But this thing is intense. Intense. So you can see what is happening. You got a window punch. Yeah, who is this big red I speak of? <laughs> exactly. And it's got a seatbelt cutter. And it's got a flipper. <laughs> And let's fire it out for the first time. And I don't know. I thought I saw this one was assisted. But it's even got a little groove right here. So you can put your thumb in there. <laughs> Patriotism just oozes off of it. I think it's still dripping patriotism. Oh, oh no. Hold on. Oh, it's not firing out. Oh, man. Hold on. I'm going to get some wrist into it. There we go. I was trying, I thought it was assisted, but it's not. Doesn't feel to be. So this is one wild knife, USA design, made in China. You can see right there. Yes, I will have to sell all my 940s now and replace this one. But yeah, from a, Mark says, from a bug out to M Tech, only on Zach's channel. <laughs> so this right here, I do have to say they almost got the lines right between the the scale and the flag on the blade. So it is a liner lock. I will have to do a, a hearty review of this one. <laughs> there we go. Okay, Knives Fast says, check out my video on the Shadow Ranger and you'll know what you're supposed to actually do with it. Perfect. So, yeah. <laughs> okay. So, that's some beauty, man. That is a solid, beautiful knife. Does not feel cheap in the hand. Only because it's a tip-down carry. But it's, it's hefty. It's super hefty. So, anyways, you guys. Big Red... <laughs> thank you thank you so much does it have the awesome 3r steel i believe it does it's stainless <laughs> it's stainless oh man yes robbie we are back with patriotism dripping off of this one as peter says <laughs> yeah you have to assist the knife What's up, Ron Forbes? Welcome, welcome, buddy. Member of Zach's Day Carry Crew. It does with no heat treat. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, the Shadow Ranger has arrived. Big Red said last week he was gonna he made this happen and he did. So thanks, buddy. I'm gonna check this one out. I may have to do a special video for this one. <laughs> oh, don't apologize, man. Oh, thanks for the support, man. Oh, thanks for the support. I'll show a little love for Big Red. Oh man, that's a that's a that's a fun one though. I have to say, like, <clears throat> if this was like a just a flat color or a regular color, I don't know if they would have sold as many. So I see what they're going for here. I see what they're going for. Um, yeah, so we'll we'll check out this one. We've got a little sunshine coming through. I like to see that. It's supposed to be raining like tomorrow and Tuesday and Wednesday or something here. So. Had some 80 degree days the last couple days, so it's pretty pretty good, but pretty early. Oh, you have a, women carry knives, so you have to check out our, our Shadow Ranger videos. They're awesome. Okay. <laughs> Hashtag America. Yeah, buddy. I can open the cans in the middle of the fight. Yeah, exactly. It's set up for Peter's gas station stuff. <laughs> That's terrific. Okay, so we got that one sent in for review. Thanks, Big Red. Uh, make sure to check out his channel as well. 
And it sounds like there's some really cool M M Tech USA Shadow Ranger videos out there. So I'll have to watch a couple of those. Make sure you guys do as well. It's a survival knife, not EDC. Oh, okay. It's survival. Survival of the fittest. Zach, Big Red, DSKFS, you. I know he did. <laughs> now you got to piff that knife. I know. I definitely have to pay it forward for sure. And <laughs> the glass breaker doesn't fall off. <laughs> Might be able to break a window. Review with a hammer. Uh, a hammer. Yeah. What's up, Lorenzo? Welcome, buddy. Member of Zach's Day of the Carry Crew. Thanks for being here. I know you're out working hard. Yeah, you said last night on SKL for Big Red's channel that you were out setting posts all day. So you're probably back at it again today. I can survive a trip to the mall to look at all the mall knives. That's fabulous. Okay, so we have something else that was sent in uh, for review. And in addition to review, there'll be a giveaway with this one. So... This, was, this stuff was sent in for review by Bastion. Now, if you haven't checked out some of Bastion's stuff, they have some really cool stuff online. Additionally, in addition to sending this stuff out and to providing a giveaway item, they provided a code for 20% off all their products. So I'm just going to lay it out there. What's up, Ian? Welcome, buddy. Member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. Thanks for being here. Bastion has a code for everything on their website. If you use the code ZS20, stands for Zach Stuff 20. ZS20. I don't get any kickback off of it. It goes right to you guys. And they provided a giveaway item. That's how I love to do this stuff. So I'm super happy they did that. But let's take a look at what they sent. So, oh, you have a carbon fiber Bastion gold, uh, bolt action pen? Okay, nice. And look at that. <laughs> they sent one. They sent a carbon fiber bolt action pen in for review. Now this has some heft to it, but bolt action, I have some bolt actions to compare it with. You know that, I like that carbon fiber look to it. That's pretty cool. Now, I'll have to look and see, because I haven't really opened these up and taken a look at them. It looks like a gel kind of uh, cartridge that comes with it. But very classy, very uh, well-rounded end here. Got your pocket clip as well. Yeah, so there's a link right there. Thanks, Big Red. I appreciate that. Yeah, exactly. So that's the carbon fiber and steel one. Let's see what else they sent in. They sent in, <laughs> I hear you KJ. Oh, so they sent in the all steel version as well. Yeah, there's the coupon code. Thanks Big Red for putting that in there. So that's the coupon code ZS20, give you 20% off. This is the all stainless steel version. Very smooth, very sleek. Now this one's heavier. This one's heavier than the carbon fiber one, of course. Okay. Okay, it's smooth. It's smooth, we'll have to check that out. I'll do a review on these, so. What's up, C. Lemansky? What's happening, man? Another member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew, thanks for being here. So yeah, so two really cool pins. Oh, Jada, thanks. Thank you so much. Thank you very, very much. Jada, thank you very much. Uh, Jada. Please send me an email, zach.edc at gmail.com. I want to send some swag out your way. Thank you very much. Yeah, show some love for Jada. That's awesome. All right, Mrs. OCD. Uh-oh, the teens are back. <laughs> Time to take care of the youngsters. All right, have fun. We'll see you later tonight. Oh, Tier 1 got some. Right on, right on. What's up, M237? Thanks for being here. Yeah, heck yeah. That's great. Yeah, so the cool part is these pens, we're going to do a giveaway as well. So look for the review on these pens. If you see the review, the link 
will be in there. Not a link. I'm sorry. The um, rules for the giveaway will be posted in that review video. So do me a favor. Check them out. There's kind of a good look at those. But yeah, that's very, very cool. Bastion send those out. You know, and it sounds like they sent them out to a couple other people as well. That is really, really nice of them to do that. So, so we're going to set those off to the side. We have one other thing that I need to make a brief appearance with only because you're going to see it come up in probably an Instagram post and maybe a video as well. And that's going to be a, uh, a really cool glow in the dark thing. Yo, oh, Peter says, I bought mine. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy. I'll send, I'll send you one. But let me move my tray of knives there. So I saw something that was glow in the dark, and I'm like, okay, does it really glow in the dark? We're not going to be able to test it right now, but I'm going to test it out tonight. I'm going to get it charged up, and we're going to take a look at it. But this is one of those work mats from Blade HQ, and this one's glow in the dark. <laughs> so it's kind of a really light green material, um, but I think you guys will dig it. So we're gonna do a really cool little photo shoot with it. Um, I'm hoping to do a video as well at night when I can share, show it off really good. And we'll definitely make sure there's some glow in the dark things on that video as well, and that photo shoot, so. No, <laughs> can't handle Instagram, but they do have it. It is available. It was on sale. Um, I think it was like $13, $14, or something like that. Do I have a UV light handy? Um, I do. Let me see if it fires up on that. Stand by. Oh, snap. Okay, so let's see here. We're going to put this down. Let me turn off a, one of the close lights here. We're gonna turn it down a little bit. You guys see that? <laughs> Look at that action. So there's, yeah, good idea on the UV light, man. Great idea on the UV light. What's up, Ryan Gilbert? It's more fun to just draw things in it, huh? But yeah, so you can tell what's gonna happen here. You can see how that stuff charges up. Yeah, so there's there's the link right there from Big Red. So fun with friends, <laughs> or just fun in general. You get some glow in the dark stuff. I'm sure none of it's like 100% uh, safe for us, but yeah. What's up, Talbert? How you doing, buddy? Welcome, welcome. Another member of Zach's Daily Carry Crew. Thanks for being here. And also, Talbert's got some cool stuff that he makes. Um, EDC pouches, those kind of things. Uh, if you mention my name or Big Red, um, you get $5 off. So definitely check out Talbert's stuff. He's got some cool things that he sent over. Pretty neat stuff. So I think that'll be a fun little video that we'll do. We'll turn the light back on here. Draw some happy little trees. Yeah, I need to get a little more uh, of a pointed uh, UV light. Oh, okay, Luke, right on. Oh, only causes cancer in California. Perfect. But yeah, so anyways, those are fun little shop mats. You can have some fun with it. I have a blue one, a black one, and I think a tan one, but I bought those. It's pretty cool stuff. What's up, T-Dollar? Oh, yeah, the, the red titanium one. Yeah, I have that right here. That one is right here. It's a wonderful knife. It's fun. It's solid titanium. I love the scales on it. Good times. Okay, so we got through that one. I want to share that one with you really quick. Now... We're going to go ahead and get into a giveaway for today. How about that? <laughs> yes, it's very sad. Happy little trees.
You guys down for a giveaway? I think so. Yeah, Luke, I won't be able to get your email till afterwards if that's cool. Unless it's something urgent, I can go grab my other computer real quick. Jay Smooth says, yeah. Big Red says, yeah. David's like, cool. Yeah, buddy. Suit Chicken, Lorenzo. Okay, we're in for the giveaway. Nice. I love it. Okay. So, in true fashion, we got some NAF Sergeant. I think that's the right way, right? I think the stripes go down. I'm going to probably get in trouble either way. I'm probably putting this wrong side. We'll do it this way. <laughs> you, can, you can correct me. But we're going to do some swag. We got some really cool stuff from some cool people. Journey Tool Company. Remove, remove before flight. Enjoy the journey. Making some good products out there. We got some knife care swabs from our friends. Our good friends over at KPL, Knife Pivot Lube. So we're going to put a couple of those in there. We're also going to have Sharper Things from Smoky Mountain Knife Works. We got some Zach stuff, holographic action going on. Some DSKFS, do something kind for someone, holographic stickers. Some more Zach stuff stickers. Of course, our friends at Southern Edge Knife Works where if you look at the link in the description below, you can get your discount and your $5 flat rate shipping. Just use that wonderful, wonderful code, Zach15. Our friend Little Fit Devil, she had a fun live stream last night. She did a giveaway on. I think you guys are all subscribed on there. She just hit 40K, so that's cool. And of course, our buddy Big Red EDC, Saturday, Saturday Knife Live, Big Red EDC, and of course, Mark's Gear. So... We got some cool swag out there we're going to put in the giveaway. Now, I had some other stuff planned for a giveaway. And, hey, what's up, Derp? How's it going? Oh, Chevrons. <laughs> I, think it's, I think it's Air Force. Who's Fit Devil? Well, if you haven't seen Fit Devil, look up little Fit Devil on YouTube. Or Instagram, or hold on. She's got it all listed on the back of her sticker. YouTube, TikTok, Twitter, Instagram. I don't know if that's Pinterest. <laughs> Most likely. All forms of social media. She's on there. Oh, uh, thanks, Big Red. Yeah, there's the there's the link and the code right there. 15% off. Five dollar flat rate shipping, Southern Edge Knife Works. They they make a lot of things happen, so you know, I've emailed them in the past and picked up a knife directly from them that not anybody else had in stock. So that was kind of cool. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Dr. Carla is awesome. Yes, indeed. No, no, that was that was a whole separate issue. Slicey Dicey put that one to rest about MC's channel. He He found out exactly why and it wasn't anything that we're doing here, so... Or any of us are doing. It was it was like a third party link thing that linked to certain things that people thought were against the rules. So that's all been put to put to sleep, put to bed, gone. We're happy, we're healthy, we're having fun. But NAF Sergeant literally said, Hey, you know, I sent that knife out and I want you to give it away. And I'm like, what? So we're going to give it away. How about we give away this Civivi button lock right here? How about we give this away today? Nice little Civivi button lock. I think that's pretty fantastic. That's pretty fantastic, NAF Sergeant. Thank you very, very much. It's very incredible. He said, hey, I want to support the live stream. I don't do very many live streams myself. So he wanted to support the community that comes to our live streams. So that's you guys. And also, like I said, don't forget, check my community tab. I know a lot of you guys have before March 20th because there's some stuff going on on my community tab. But that's so awesome. Thank you very much, NAF Sergeant. So we're going to do the number game. We're going to do a little giveaway for that. And what it means is I'm going to give you a spread of numbers 
And in that spread of numbers, you're going to guess once. Once only. And we're going to do closest without going over. If we have a tie or several people that guess the right one, then we'll go to a round two with just those couple people. So, yeah. So that's pretty cool stuff. Oh, made, made you buy the James Brand Barnes? Yeah, I looked at that, but it was just, for what it is, is out of my price range. So... Yeah, John, very, very cool. Nebu Cloud, yeah, do something kind for someone. You know, he really stepped up and he's like, hey, I want to I wanna give back to this community that's so supportive. So, yeah, definitely an awesome man, Peter, for sure. So, like I said, if you haven't checked out Knife Sergeant's channel, <laughs> definitely do that. Exactly one minute knife reviews. Did I win? Yeah, one guess, one guess only. Close to about going over. My screen, my moderator screens will be the final say. And um, I'll give you the spread in just a minute here. But it looks like we got 125 people, a little more. So we'll go ahead and do a spread here. I'll give you that in just a minute because I'm going to do that after we get the start from Big Red. So hold on. We're going to pick a number between such and such and such and such. But we've got to make it fun. We've got to make it popping. Okay, so I've got it written down. Let me fold it up and put it on the screen. Hey, Scott, thanks for being here, buddy. Yeah, we're just getting into uh, the giveaway, and you'll find out here in just a minute what it's going to be. There is the start from Big Red. There's the paper underneath the knife, so nobody can see the number. So the number range is going to be between 700 and 900. Uh, Robbie, if you can provide a U.S. shipping address then you can participate for sure. And if you win and, uh, you know, you can't, then we'll at least get some swag to you for sure. We'll get all the swag pack for sure. We'll find something else, but. All the guests is coming in now. One guess, one guess only between 700 and 900. People are ripping through. All the good guesses coming in. Got all the guesses. I like it. I like seeing it. So many great people here. Thank you guys for being here. So fantastic. Having a great Sunday. We got some more live streams coming up. Some great people. I'm going to go back and catch up on the race a little bit. And then I'll be there. Women Carry Knives, 2.30 Pacific. I'll be there for that one. Once only, but I need to make sure it's in. Yeah, it's in one minute. There's none of them that have been flagged at all, so all the guesses are coming in. Yeah, Luke, the weather's good today, you know? We had a 80-degree day yesterday, and we got another one today. Uh, and then it's going to be raining tomorrow. We're going to need some rain, so that southern Oregon, uh, northern California is going through some some uh, rough weather right now. They need some rain, so. Yeah, definitely, Mark. Definitely awesome for everybody's generosity, no matter who wins, so. Let's see here. Let me go back. I can't even, I'm trying to remember what the number was that I picked. I was like, oh, this is great. And then I'm like, I didn't write it down on my side. Oh, it just started raining there, Randy? Oh, okay, okay. You're right on the coast? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, nice. I started watching, I gotta tell you guys this. This is just a little bit about me while we're getting some more guesses coming in. So I started watching some, uh, a freestyle rapper. And, you know, his channels, he's got, he's about, got some good followers. I think he's coming up on like a million or something like that. Oh yeah, make sure to hit the like button. Heck yeah, while you're here, hit that like button. And, uh, oh, rains between showers in Ireland. <laughs> nice, Donkey Dave. But uh, his name's Harry Mack. And I have to tell you, at first I was like, okay. But then I went back and watched some of his stuff like 
from the last couple years and then now recent some of his stuff and you know with all the stuff with the pandemic he's been doing like some omega stuff kind of surprise you know people just pop on he's like hey man give me three or four words and i'm just gonna freestyle rap and it's just amazing oh you love harry mac too nice z man it's just like wow so it's kind of cool to watch all that stuff and then he's got some stuff from when he's in venice beach and everything else and i'm like man that guy is amazing so anyways that's just some stuff like when i'm doing editing and i'm uploading stuff i love to just turn on his video because you can listen to it and kind of watch people's reaction on some of them. And I'm like, oh, man. Oh, watch the Smack Battle League. Oh, okay. I haven't seen that one. Okay. So let's see. We got Deborah's vote in as well. Oh, you grew up in Indiana? Nice, nice. So anyways, I know it's it's not for everybody. Oh, <laughs> Big Red's like, there's his channel. So anyways, Harry Mack, if you ever watch this, much love, dude. You're an amazing person with what you do. So, but he just like literally picks up on stuff, you know, and he's seeing stuff in like people's screen on their, on their, uh, you know, he's putting in the words that he's supposed to, that people give him. But then he's like seeing like, they got a light, this light on and he's got, you know, this, these curtains and this other stuff. And he's just going, he's just mixing with it. So it's pretty cool how, how quick his mind thinks and he puts it all and he just gets it into there. So I'll have to check that out, Mark. That's pretty cool stuff. Anyways, so that's just a little bit from me, what, I, what I've been listening to. You know, I try to listen to, like, you know, Big Red has some great knife chats and stuff, so I've been listening to those as well. But one of those popped up here a couple weeks ago, and I was like, what is this? And I'm like, huh, and then I started listening. I'm like, oh, man, that's, that's wild. So <laughs> Donkey Dave says, rap, oh, no, me old. Um, yeah, you watch a four hour stream of injustice to gaming terminate. Oh, wow. That's cool. That's wild. All right. Cody's got his guess in big red. We'll give it about 30 seconds. We'll throw up some stop signs and then we'll go back and check some of these comments and see, uh, who we got the closest and hopefully we got a winner. Josh got his in just now, just in time. But yeah, Harry Max got some sick raps. Freestyle, freestyle. Well, that's cool, Jay Smooth. And thanks again, Nav Sergeant. That's pretty cool. Luke says, uh, I feel like you might like the slow rush by Tame Impala. Hmm, I'll have to check that out. All right, we got a couple in there at the last minute from Thomas Vu and Josh L. Wrapping up the guesses. My favorite 940, if I had to choose Alex, is going to be the 940 BK 2002. The black uh, blade, the blue G10. So, let's go ahead and see who we got as the closest in the spread from 700 to 900. It was 816. So we'll go back and look and see if we have an 816. I see an 811 by Grateful Panic. 812 by Women Carry Knives. Uh, 812 by Other Intended Purposes. Don't know if that's going to be the closest. Oh, we have Dane with an 816. Dane with an 816. That might be the only one. Guessing it right on the money. Let's see. Oh, man. It's looking pretty close. Looking like Dane might have it. Deborah had 812 as well. Man, if Dane wasn't there... We were going to have a, an 812 round two with a bunch of people. Oh, Nick. Oh, <laughs> you didn't guess that one? Oh, it's your birthday, too. Well, congratulations, Dane. Uh, send me a message or an email. Uh, you got my contact info, and we'll get this shipped out to you. Man, you guys. Thanks again so much to Cole for sending out the Spider Co's. 
for Bastion for sending out the pens for review and giveaway. Naf Sergeant for the knives and the giveaway knife. That's amazing, my friend. Big Red and the Therapeutic Edge. Thanks for being here and moderating. Women Carry Knives as well, moderating. You guys are incredible. The whole knife community. Thanks for Zach's Daily Carry Crew for being here and continuing your support. You guys, I seriously can't do this without you guys, you know? It's a fun, fun hobby. And to be able to review and do things like this, I got some fun things planned. Things are just starting to open up here in Oregon. Thanks, Talbert. I appreciate it. We're, uh, we're going to be starting some of those idea uh, videos that I had in the, in the books. Um, I'm working on a couple things with Benchmade as well. So wish me luck on that. And a couple other knife manufacturers here in the area in Portland. So we'll get some good stuff going out. Um, again, huge shout out to everybody. Don't forget. Thanks, Mechanic Mike. I appreciate it. Don't forget to check out Women Carry Knives, 230 Pacific. Don't forget to check out Slicey Dicey, 8 p.m. Eastern. And then, of course, OCD and Mrs. OCD Free DC at 8 p.m. Central. So, Didier, Tim Cook, thank you guys so much. Make sure to do something kind for someone. You guys have been amazing this week. Keep it up. Keep it rolling. We definitely need that here in the community for sure. Um, yeah, Luke, I really hope so. I really hope we get a, a Zach's custom exclusive Benchmade 940 here soon. So you guys have an awesome rest of your day. Most importantly, take care. We will see you very, very soon. Talk to you later.